みなさんこんにちはみほこです Hello everyone, it's Mihoko Today, I'll introduce you to how you say It's getting something something in Japanese And there are some different ways to say that And I'll show you the differences as well では始めましょう Let's get started! If you have any questions about this video or anything else about learning Japanese and the culture, please feel free to ask me in the comment section below. And please subscribe to this channel and hit the like button for me if you liked this video. That would be a great support for me. The conjugation of adjective for this example I'm going to show you now. Furu, fute, furu, fute. This furu means like come down. And then, ame is rain. So, ame ga furu. Rain down, have rain, rain on. And then, ame ga fute for the conjugation form. Conjugated form is ame ga fute. Then, regular form, ame ga furu. Conjugation, ame ga fute. Example A. Short form. Ame ga fute kita. Ame ga fute kita. Long form. 雨が降ってきました。雨が降ってきました。It started rain. These are the basic simple form. When conjugated adjective plus 来ちゃった。来てしまった。来てしまいました。来ちゃいました。These forms add the feeling that something happened for the speaker which isn't unpleasant. Example B. Short form. 雨が降ってきちゃった。雨が降ってきちゃった。Casual and colloquial style. 雨が降ってきてしまった。雨が降ってきてしまった。This one is a literary style. Long form. 雨が降ってきてしまいました。雨が降ってきてしまいました。If you If you want to add a casual touch while speaking in a polite style of Japanese, you can say, 雨が降ってきちゃいました。Oh, let me say that again. 雨が降ってきちゃいました。雨が降ってきちゃいました。This one is slightly casual. Just be careful and use, it, use this one. In the right situation. And all of them meaning, unfortunately, it started to rain. It's basically about, basically saying, it started to rain. But, um, kind of adding the feeling, unfortunately. So these are the differences between these four And the basic form. Conjugation of adjective. Nemui. Nemui. Sleepy. Drazi. Nemuku natte. Getting sleepy. Nemuku natte. Nemui. Into. Nemuku natte.
Example A. Short form. 眠くなってきた。眠くなってきた。Long form. 眠くなってきました。眠くなってきました。I'm getting sleepy. Example B. Short form. 眠くなってきてしまった。眠くなってきてしまった。This one is a literary style of short form. 眠くなってきちゃった。This one is more casual short form. Very c o l l c o l l too. And then long form. 眠くなってきてしまいました。And other one is, 眠くなってきちゃいました This one is still polite form and, but slightly casual. 眠くなってきてしまいました This is a basic long form, basic polite form. 眠くなってきちゃいました And this one is slightly casual. And the meaning is, I hate to say that, but I'm getting sleepy. This Japanese sentence means, I'm getting sleepy. And that's the same as example A, but this time, there's an extra nuance like, I hate to say that, but. So, These like from, 来てしまった、来ちゃった、来てしまいました、来ちゃいました、adding this nuance. I hate to say that, but. Conjugation of adjective. 寒い。cold. feel cold. 寒い。寒くなって、getting cold. 寒くなって、getting cold. 寒い、into, 寒くなって。Example A. Short form. 寒くなってきた。寒く、なってきた。long form 寒くなってきました。寒くなってきました。it's getting cold。example V short form this one is literary style 寒くなってきてしまった。寒くなってきてしまった。And then, next one is more casual and c o o k i o style. 寒くなってきちゃった。寒くなってきちゃった。Long form. 寒くなってきてしまいました。寒くなって来てしまいました。And then, next one is slightly more casual. 寒くなってきちゃいました。寒くなってきちゃいました。I will read them with natural speed again. Short one. 寒くなってきてしまった。寒くなってきちゃった。Long form. 寒くなってきてしまいました。寒くなってきちゃいました。Oh, the meaning is, it's meaning it's getting cold, but having nuance as I'm not excited about it, but it's getting cold.
That's all for today. 皆さん、お疲れ様でした。Good job, everyone! Thanks for watching and listening to this video. I hope you learned something new about Japanese culture or the language today. If you like this video, please hit the like button for me. Be sure to subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. I will keep uploading something good for you to learn about Japanese language every week. See you in the next video! またねー。